Well, spring break is in full effect this week for area students as well as for visitors from people from all over the area visiting here to the Sun Coast this week. Marla Spence is right now visiting Lido Key with a yeah. preview of what police are doing to keep these folks safe. Marla? Yeah, guys, law enforcement is making sure that they are highly visible at beaches like Lido Beach, also Siesta Key, and they'll also be patrolling waterways with their marine units and also parking lots. Now, Sun Coast uh, teens and also college students are not the only ones on spring break this week, but so are the young kids, those in elementary and also in middle school uh, throughout Manatee and Sarasota counties. More than likely, many of those students will be staying at home while their parents are at work this spring break. Lieutenant Brian with the Sarasota Sheriff's Office tells us parents should make sure their child is old enough and also mature enough to stay home. Lieutenant Brown also says although parents may be busy at work, communication is key between you and your child, especially when they are at home alone throughout the spring break. They have a good way to communicate with each other, make sure that uh, the parents have phones or cell phones nearby, um, that they can communicate with their children. In addition to having phones nearby for your kids at home, uh, Lieutenant Brown says a good idea would be to leave a list of phone numbers and don't assume that your kids know those numbers by heart to leave your work number, your cell number, as well as close relatives phone numbers and even a close family friend or even a, a classmate, their parents. You can also leave those phone numbers with your kids as well, just in case of an emergency. Reporting at Lido Beach, I'm Marla Spence for ABC 7, your Suncoast News.